Today's video is to celebrate National Beautician's Day. Maxwell's for hair, may I help you? Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. If you're brand new to my channel, thank you so much for stopping by. And if you're already subscribed, welcome back. Always a pleasure to have you. Today I am here with Jeannie Maxwell of Maxwell's for Hair and we're going to learn everything about Jeannie and the world of being a beautician and how she became a beautician. So Jeannie, thank you so much You're for welcome. having me. Thanks I really for coming appreciate by. It. Thank you. Why don't you tell us a little bit about how did you get started as a beautician? Well, I started right out of high school. The summer that I graduated, I had gotten a scholarship in high school okay. to go to the beauty college. So at 18, I started. Been doing it now for 45 years or so. And what do you enjoy about being a beautician? What I really like is having um, a relationship with the people that I do. You know, most of them I've done for many, many years. And it, it's more about them any more than their hair, although I love to do hair, but uh, I love my people. I have to admit that. <laughs> As a beautician, what is one of the favorite things that you like to do? I really like to do color. I really enjoy uh, doing weaves, balayage, um, taking the gray away. And you said something about creating. You like creating. Yeah, creating styles. new hairstyles for somebody that wants a, a major change. That's always really fun. Really, is that one of do. the biggest things that I mean? When people like me, if I were to come in and say, "Give me something new," what would you recommend? <laughs> yeah, well, um, your hair is beautiful, so it, it's nothing that needs to be done. You don't need any kind of changes. But I think maybe shortening it, layering it more, having it shorter around it, your eyes and your face to bring more attention, but <laughs> it's great the way it is. It oh, is beautiful. Thank you. What does it mean to you to be a beautician? I love having my own place. My husband is here with me. He's a barber stylist. Um, but being able to create our own ambiance, you had mentioned that, that word, to be able to talk about what we want to talk about in our salon and people saying, no, no, you can't talk about that. No, we are going to because <laughs> this is who we are and this is our place. Right. So, so you've, uh, you've made it your own. Yeah. So if you haven't already been <laughs> here to Maxwell's for hair in orange, this is such a beautiful shop. When I first walked in, the ambiance, and it's very welcoming. It's very, um, very, very quaint, and I love it. It's, I think you've really made it what it is, I think. Um, from the stations to just the appearance, everything about it, I think it's very nice. Well, one thing we were after was to, for me anyway, to make it more home-like because we're going to spend so many hours here. I didn't want something super modern that was not who I am, right. you know, so that's kind of how we <laughs> developed it over the years. Right. So here at Maxwell's for Hair, you do, you service both men and women, correct? Yes, we do. We all, all of us girls do men's hair, but we also have two barbers that do exclusively men's hair. And uh, one is my husband's. And for somebody starting out, a budding creative person wants to get into be being a beautician, what would you recommend? Um, I think the best way to start is to be an assistant for somebody and shadow somebody that they enjoy being around, you know, because you're going to spend a lot of a lot of time with them. But um, slowly kind of building into a chair, a lot of salons will let you uh, have a chair part-time and so you can shadow somebody and then bring your friends in one at a time and, and learn that way because it's so different than working what you learn in the beauty school when you get out in the real world it's completely different so well that's it everybody thank you so much for watching we hope you truly enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up comment down below and let us know what part of Jeannie's wonderful Maxwell's for hair you enjoy and if you haven't already subscribed please hit the subscribe button down below don't forget to hit this notification bell so anytime we upload a video you'll be notified thank you again for watching and be sure to stick around for all the celebration awareness series videos and we'll see you in my next video thank you bye
for watching. Be sure to comment and like below. What is uh, See what happens? Edit, edit, edit. Okay. <laughs>